John Smoltz joins us. Now, John, who's played golf with Michael Jordan, probably lost money to Michael Jordan. Have you ever taken money from Michael Jordan on the uh, golf course? Oh, yeah. 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 This uh, greatest competitor of all time, uh, what you don't do is you don't talk trash. You just play possum. You don't try to be anything other than just go about your business. And at the end of the day, hopefully you beat them. But if you talk trash, if you get them riled up, similar to Tiger, you're going to lose. Uh, have you seen that happen? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look, funny story. First time I ever played him, he was still playing in the big league. Or I was still playing in the big leagues. He was still playing in the NBA. We played in Chicago on a 38-degree day. And I had no resume. I had no resume. We were the only ones on the course. And he had a putt for, I don't know, 25 feet for birdie in the last hole. If he makes it and I miss my seven-footer, he wins. And uh, he stands up over the putt and, like, he lines it up. And then he steps back and he goes – he rattles off his resume <laughs> as if this is no big deal. You know, won three MVPs. Whatever it was at the time is impressive. And then he made the putt. And I'm like, well, now what do I do? I stand over my putt and I go, we lost 100 games two years in a row. Uh, I had nothing to go to. <laughs> Luckily, I made my putt. But I realized just even the time spent with him over the years and, and Tiger, there's just such a different level. And you, you get intimidated just hearing uh, when somebody can kind of quote or say all that their resume kind of speaks to. All right, help me understand tonight. You got Japan against the United States. I would think this is the matchup that you want if you're Fox. Um, tell us what to look forward to tonight. Well, you're you're seeing one of the most complete teams in Team Japan from the first person on the roster to Shohei Otani. Um, I'm amazed by their discipline, the way they go about their game. They all wear the same suits, the same shirt, and the same tie. Like everything is about unison and the fact that everything they do is has a reason and a structure behind it. No different than that game last night. They were able to come back because they didn't waver or play or get outside their game. So you're going to see one through nine have a complete approach at the plate, unlike anything or any roster that we put together, because the style of baseball is different in the U.S. We have more swing and miss, more homer type guys, and our lineup is stud lineup. But that's what you're going to see. You're going to see – uh, Darvish, who the it, it, kind of a good thing for the team USA that they know that pitcher, yeah. even as good as he is, it helps their lineup be familiar with the kind of stuff they're going to see. And then I got this sneaky p suspicion that maybe late in the game, if team Japan is up, you may see Shohei Otani close it out. And would it be something oh, more than theater yeah. that if Shohei Otani with two outs and a runner on is facing Mike Trout, for the chance to win the WBC either way would be pretty incredible if it actually happens. Help us understand uh, Roki Sazaki, the 21-year-old. How good is he? And uh, what's the destination or time destination for to him uh, to end up in uh, Major League Baseball? Yeah, it's interesting. Everyone's saying anywhere between three and six years based on the protocols that, it, that uh, they have over in Japan. He is dynamic. I mean, they're talking about – ahead of Otani and his pitching. And we all know what Otani's doing as a pitcher. His ability to throw a fastball free and easy and repeat his mechanics and that split finger, he didn't even throw his slider or curveball. And I'm I'm not blown away by too many hyped up moments. I've had the Strasburg moment. I had, and he lived up to that hype that night. He struck out 14. And of course, his career has been unfortunately undone by injuries. But this kid is special. And so there were 64 scouts now that number doesn't make sense to me there's 30 teams <laughs> do i really need two from every team but there were 64 people watching him pitch last night but why three and to six years john the the posting for certain teams i've got i learned to understand it's six years before you can post unless the request is granted by the player and or the club and then it's a lot less the player can make there's all kinds of different rules for the posting now uh, Shohei Otani and Darvish had their posting was so great that the Japanese built a basically new brand new stadium okay. over there because of the posting that comes to them. So they understand eventually he's going to go. It, it really is an individual choice and, of course, club control over the time frame. How big is the WBC? And can you see where we're not waiting four years? 
Well, you know, there's so much conversation around what the Team USA hasn't had on their roster in the past, and it's starting to be filled up a little bit better. There's some restrictions, of course, that the conversation always goes like this. Look, if your mindset, you come to spring training, you think you're going to get hurt, you're going to get hurt. But we have players get hurt in spring training all the time, and we don't really notice it. But if somebody gets hurt in the WBC, we bang the drum and it's got to be canceled. So there's got to be this understanding from the clubs and USA Baseball Federation that the more stars we have, the better it is. And those countries are starting to showcase their stars and getting to a point where now that's why the excitement is the way it is. And it's played out with Mike Trout playing. And he had guarantee of, from everything I've heard, he's going to spread the word wherever he goes to any player in the big leagues saying you want to be part of this, that's going to help the future of WBC gain more and more attraction because this has been an epic one. This has been one that everyone's been waiting for for a long time. Have fun tonight, John. Great to talk to you. My pleasure. Go Spartans. That's John Smoltz, Hall of Famer.